Muy buena gente, sean bienvenidos, yo soy amigo Vir, estamos en otro capítulo más de Kenshin Impact, en este caso vamos a ver lo que es la historia de Bennett, eh, el sueño valiente, o el, la suerte valiente, se me olvida el nombre, que le puse una aventura maravillosa, eso sí sé que así se llama, así que chicos espero les guste, lo traigo con mucho cariño, eh, le he dedicado un poquito de tiempo, ahí se ve... La bolsita de las abritas, aunque parece una piedra literalmente. Espero les guste el capítulo. Recuerden, solamente es un final que yo saco. Y posteriormente hago un video donde se ven todos los finales. Y explico un poquito más o menos del personaje con respecto a esos finales. Así que chicos, espero les guste. Nos vamos a ver qué tiene que decirnos Benito, ¿vale? Vamos a ver, ¿vale? Vamos a ver qué nos tiene que decir Benito. Uh, pues ven a Catherine. Sí, tú eres un placer, Bennett. Estaba emocionado por verme, ¿me admiras? Mm. I'm totally jealous of all your achievements. El equipo de aventura ah, no suena tan mal. Word's been spreading in adventurer circles for a long time now. Your adventure team shows up all over the continent. It might look like you're just handling a bunch of boring commissions, but then, as soon as something big goes down, eh, solo es casualidad. Anyway, I just really envy you. You're sort of like the protagonist of this world or something. Mmm, no creo. On the other hand. I'm just some unlucky guy. My adventure team even... Uh, never mind. I shouldn't get all down in the dumps in front of someone I admire. I should be open to see what I can learn. Okay. Speaking of which, I have a favor to ask. Ahora, ¿qué necesitas? When you go adventuring later, can I come ¿Por qué solo a mirar, dice? ¿No quieres echarme una mano? Uh, <laughs> maybe you don't know. I'm a really unlucky claro person. Claro que no, Benito. If you brought me along on an adventure, my bad luck would probably just screw everything up. No, no, que no. I don't want to get you into any trouble. So, just let me watch from the sidelines. That'd be good enough for me. Quizás, pero podríamos hacer algo distinto. No te preocupes, ven conmigo. Really? I didn't mishear you, did I? No, no me escuchaste mal. Go adventure with you? Just like we do if I was on your Así adventure? es. No soy tan increíble como piensas. Yo también he querido ir a aventuras contigo para oh, siempre. Shucks. Hearing you say that has got me all flustered, <laughs> but I'm happy to hear it. Claro, me cae bien. By the way, since we've got this rare chance to work together, let me share some recent intel with you. Mm -hmm. A ver. According to my friend Fischl in the guild, a mysterious and dangerous ruin has recently been discovered. Ooh. Based on how the guild ranks the difficulty of its commissions, it's probably between a rank B and a rank A. Ooh. Normally, I wouldn't feel confident about taking on this level of commission. After all, with my poor luck, it's safer for me to take on commissions that are a few notches lower than my actual ability. <laughs> mm. But since you'll be joining me this time, it'll be a piece of cake. Robert de Hamlin, la Lira Sagrada, cuenta como encargo de nivel S. Trotar a este entorno cuenta como cargo ese. There's no way the guild would issue an illegal commission like that. <laughs> By the way, this ruin might be a dangerous one, but that usually means there'll be some great treasure. Sí, te dicen el busca tesoro. Por cierto, si no recordaban. Oh, uh, do you usually make some food before you set out on an adventure? Ah, uh, sí. Hmm, the cautious choice. No wonder you're so good at this. Seems I really can learn a few things from you. <laughs> vale. In that case, as per your tradition, let's get cooking. Oh yeah, I actually invented a pretty nice dish recently. I can't say it's super tasty, but I think it'd be perfect for an adventure. ¿Qué tal si yo un ingrediente en tu cocina? I'll show you cool. I really miss that old feeling of working with a partner. The ingredients needed for this dish are mint, radish, and slime condensate. One of each, please. You got that right. I'll wait for you near the pot at Good Hunter. Come find me when you're done collecting. Okay. Now that we've got our ingredients, allow me to handle the cooking. 
Ok, Benito cocina, vamos a ver qué también cocina. I forgot the exact order you're supposed to add the ingredients in, but it should be all right. I'll pack it up and leave it with you until we get to the ruins. Yo creo que se puede comer. Este plato huele a mala suerte. I think so. Should be pretty much basically the same as when I first came up with it. Ok. So, yep. Well, now that the food is ready, let's head for those mysterious ruins. Ok. Abre un poquito los ojos. A ver. Hola, Benito. It feels pretty ordinary here. I was expecting some kind of sense of impending doom. Mm. Could it be that because you're here with me, I'm feeling more at ease? <laughs> huh. It looks like the door in the front is closed and only the door behind us is open. That mechanism must be for opening the next door, right? Right. Well, we're vale, pues vamos a darle. At least. I'll go try to operate it. Ok, se abre la puerta. Se cierran las demás. Just as I expected. <laughs> hmm. Pero la puerta de atrás está cerrada. Ah, so it is. Hmm. A true adventurer can't just barge on forward. It's also important to make sure there is a way back. That's what my dad's always said. Hmm, interesante. Let me try the mechanism one more time. It seems to be un proyecto que no un proyecto. Entonces, ¿estamos atrapados? At least, it seems that way for now. But, don't let it get you down. This kind of thing happens all the time. We just have to believe that there's always a way out. What the... What's going on? Hey, did you hear that? It sounded like it came from the door up ahead of us. Could there be other people in the ruin too? Eso parece. Let's go check it out. Over there, another adventurer by the looks of it. Royce. Hello, fellow adventurer. We, like you, are here to. Bennett? Uh, Royce? It's you. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. Oh, please. Oh, no, no, no. I'm so happy to see you again. How are you doing? I've been thinking about you and the other guild members a lot recently. This is the worst. Why did I have to run into you? Oh. It took me forever to get this door open. Finally, I was about to advance further in, and all of a sudden, it closes again. Oh. Uh, I guess that's because I activated the mechanism just now. I knew it. I knew it. Of course it was you. I knew it as soon as I saw you. As long as you are around, no adventure can ever be a smooth ride. Oye, no seas tan duro con él. ¿Cómo puedes echarle la culpa de todo lo demás? And what the heck were you thinking, teaming up with Bennett? Hey, don't fight, don't fight. Let me introduce Royce, a former member of Benny's adventure team and an old friend of mine. Friend? I didn't even tell you I was leaving the team and you still think of me as... your friend? Porque eres un culero. Never mind. I'm a little on edge because what just happened. I'm sorry. Well, it was my fault. <laughs> you think? I left because at that time, I really couldn't stand it a second longer. My adventures always used to go off without a hitch. But after joining your adventure team, I was tripping and falling one day, getting struck by lightning the next. Oh, and the number of times ruins would cave in on us? I just couldn't dismiss it as mere coincidence anymore. The last straw was when my left leg got hit by that random explosion that came out of nowhere. After that, I couldn't stand it anymore, both literally and figuratively. <sighs> so I left and went back to being an independent adventurer. Si realmente tuviera que ir un rayo no estaría vivo, muchacho. The horror stories about Benny's adventure team. <sighs> no es que Benny tenga mala suerte por gusto. Y por eso lo abandonaste. I didn't about it much the time. I was just focused on my own survival, but there was no other way. All right, all right. It's all in the past now. Talking about all the bad things that happened will only make you more upset, right? Um, Royce, I still want to say sorry for all the trouble I caused you. Oh. <sighs> no need to apologize to me. Hmm. I've made my fair share of mistakes too. Oh, yeah. 
There's one more thing I need to tell you. The door we came through on the way in mm -mm. also got closed, and I don't think we can get it open again. So we're probably trapped here now. What a pain in the butt. <laughs> <sighs> Bennett! <laughs> Everything always goes wrong when I'm with you. Oh, well, there's nothing I can do. No tiene por qué ser coincidencia, o sea. <sighs> What am I gonna do? I've used up all my supplies already. This is it. This is how I go, isn't it? Here, today, and all because of. Insisto, le sigue echando la culpa a Bennett. Well, I don't know what I could do to apologize. If you don't mind, maybe we can share some of our supplies with you. No le des nada que se joda. But of course, I'll have to check with my partner first. So, what do you think? Que se joda, no le des nada, no. No le debes nada a este tipo, Ben. Tú lo cocinaste, tú decides qué hacer. All right. I am quite hungry. I suppose I shall accept your kind offer. Is this the supplies you were talking about? Why do I have the feeling that this dish is a bit suspect? Oops. It's fine, honestly. It's been with my partner all along, so it shouldn't be tainted with my bad luck. If that's true, then okay. Anyway, this is not a time to <laughs> pick. Then y eso va a quedar. Little bite. Uh, tastes a little, huh? What a strange <coughs> texture. La balita, hermano. What is that churning feeling in my stomach? Bennett. Hey, what's wrong, Royce? Me ah, quedó bien tieso mirándolo por el lado. Bueno, menos mal que fue Rocky se lo comió. Un <risa> buen final, gente. Un buen final. <risa> Se lo jodieron también por cabrón. Eso le pasa por culero. Bueno, gente, eh, espero les haya gustado el, el capítulo de Bennett. Estuvo la verdad muy divertido. Qué bueno, porque el tipo se empezó a insultarlo y todo. Y, y qué pasado de lanza. Nunca deben tratar así a, la, a alguien a pesar de tanta mala suerte que tenga. Eh, porque les puede pasar eso. <risa> les puede pasar esa mala suerte de él a ustedes. Así que nos vemos, chicos. Espero les haya gustado el capítulo. Soy Black Dream. Nos despido. Y nos vemos a la próxima o el próximo video donde veremos eh, todos los finales de Venezuela. Nos vemos. Bye. <risa> Buena esa, Benito.